This episode of Like You is sponsored by Hatch. Mindfulness can help you wind down before bed, and the Hatch Rest has exclusive content to help. Learn more about Hatch in this episode's show notes and get $5 off Rest with the code Like You. That's one word, all caps. And as always, Like You is made possible by our subscribers on Patreon and Apple Podcasts. Subscribe now for bonus content and other subscriber perks. And now, on to the show. Hello, I'm Noah, and this is Like You, a mindfulness podcast for kids. I'm so glad you're here. On this episode, we'll learn about the magic spark that lives in each of you and how to recharge our magic. So listeners of all ages, find a place to listen where you feel comfortable and safe. I invite everyone listening to be a part of this podcast. That means you. You can use your imagination, share your thoughts, and speak up when I ask questions or invite you to say affirmations. As always, if you'd rather just think things quietly in your mind, that's okay too. Let's begin with a breathing exercise to help calm your body and clear your mind. Let's pretend that your breath is full of magic. Imagine that when you blow your breath out, you can make anything appear out of thin air. We'll do a few magic breaths together now. I'll start small and simple. Hold your hand flat in front of your face. Imagine you can make an apple appear in your hand. Charge up your magic breath by taking a long, deep breath in. One, two, three. Then blow on your hand and imagine an apple appearing there. Not bad for your first try. Let's try something a little harder. Next, imagine you have a top hat and you want to magically pull a rabbit out of your hat. Take the hat off your head and hold it in front of you. Now charge your magic with a deep breath in. One, two, three and blow into the top hat. One, two, three. Now imagine reaching into the hat and pulling out a cute little bunny. Impressive. Now you can feed that apple to the rabbit. Okay, let's go for something really big. Let's make a unicorn appear out of nowhere. Ready to try? This will take a big, deep, strong breath. Your biggest one yet. Here we go. Charge your magic by breathing in slow and deep. One, two, three. Now blow as long and hard as you can. And imagine a unicorn materializing out of thin air. Wow. I hope you have a good place to keep your new pet unicorn. Maybe we should have asked your parents about that first. Let's do one last magic breath. This time, you can choose anything that you'd like to make appear in front of you. Take a moment to think about what you would like it to be. Feel free to tell me what it is, or just think it in your head. Okay, once you've thought of something, here we go. Charge your magic with a deep breath in. One, two, three. Now blow your magic out. One, two, three three, and imagine whatever you chose appearing before your eyes. Whatever you chose, I hope it's something that makes you feel good deep down inside. Now on the count of three, we'll all say, I like me. One, two, three. I like me. I like you too. You have a special spark inside that makes you wonderful and unique. Let's talk a little more about that special spark inside you. We'll call it your magic spark. There are lots of things that make you special, and I want you to spend a few minutes thinking about them. What's one thing 
you really like about yourself? What is something you do that takes a lot of talent? What is something you do that makes other people laugh or smile? What is something you do to be kind to other people? And what is something that you just love to do? Every person listening probably had different answers to all these questions. Maybe you shared some things in common with others, but we're all unique individuals. But there's no one else exactly like you. Your answers to these questions are some of the things that make you uniquely you. They're what gives you your magic spark. And one thing that makes that magic spark grow brighter is when we meet other people who appreciate our spark and who share some things in common with our magic. That's what you might call a friend. When two friends come together, the magic sparks unite and grow even stronger. Take a moment to think of a friend or two or ten who help you see your magic spark. Never forget that there is a magic spark in you and in everyone you meet. If you ever feel that your magic spark is growing dim, you can recharge it. By taking deep breaths, thinking positive thoughts, and getting some rest. You can also recharge it by spending time with people you love and who love you. Let's say a few affirmations together now. Think of these affirmations as magic spells you can say to yourself to recharge your spark. You can say them out loud or inside your head. I'll say each affirmation twice so you can listen the first time and say it with me the second time. Here we go. I am full of wow. I am full of wow. I embrace the magic inside me. I embrace the magic inside me. I choose to let my light shine. I choose to let my light shine. I am so proud of who I am. I am so proud of who I am. I treat others with kindness and respect. I treat others with kindness and respect. I deserve to feel joy. I deserve to feel joy. Good things are going to come to me. Good things are going to come to me. Now let's take a few slow, deep breaths as we wind down our time together. If any of those affirmations stood out to you, feel free to write them down or just store them safely in your mind to say when you need it. If you have an affirmation that is special to you, I would love to hear it. You can even send a recording of an affirmation to play on the show. Have a grown-up check our website or show notes for more information. I'd like to end this episode with a song called We Are Magic. As you listen, you can recharge your magic with deep breaths or think about the friends who share your magic spark. Or as always, just relax and listen as I sing. I am magic, you are magic, we are magic, don't forget it. I am magic, you are magic, we are magic, don't forget it. No one else is exactly like you. You've got something that only you can do. No one else is exactly like you. Everyone has their magic too. I am magic, you are magic, we are magic. Magic, you are magic.
magic, we are magic, don't forget it. And your magic makes my magic stronger. And my magic makes your magic stronger. And your magic makes my magic stronger. And my magic makes your magic stronger. I am magic. And your can't wait to spend some time together again soon. Until then, I like you, I'm proud of you, and I'm glad we are friends. Have a happy and peaceful day. Like You is a production of Perpetual Motion. It is made possible by our subscribers on Apple Podcasts and Patreon. Become a supporter by tapping subscribe on our show page in Apple Podcasts or by visiting patreon.com slash like you podcast. You can also tell your friends about the show or leave a five-star review wherever you listen to podcasts. Like You is written and hosted by me, Noah Glenn. I also composed and performed the Like You theme music and other music that appeared in this episode. Our podcast cover art was illustrated by Maya Sane, and our episode art is created by Lindsay Glenn. Grown-ups can find more information about Like You by visiting our website at likeyoupodcast.com. Thanks for listening.